So I want to share another small domestic meditation with you. Sometimes when I'm feeling distracted or anxious, overwhelmed by the largeness of the news coming from outside my small space, I practice focusing on an object just beyond my window. Green leaves, the stinging nettles outside my boat, this lemon balsam plant that was given to me by my friend. I'm sitting next to it now. I look carefully at it and closely and I touch the leaves. I smell them. They smell delicious. I take deep breaths. In, out, in, out. In, out. And I just spend some time looking carefully at the leaves, allowing my eye just to rest gently on their surface. The light is shining through. I can see all their veins. I look closer and closer. So my gaze becomes really quite minute and telescopic. I turn away from the large and I see the small specks running down these veins. They look like old ladies' hands or old ladies' fans. And I breathe deeply. In, out, in, out. And I just let my eye travel up and down the stems. One, two, three. And all the wider thoughts and the wider perspective, which my mind has been tangled in this morning, drops away. In, out, in, out and my eye and my mind begins to see small things again sees the tiny shadows the black specks on the leaf surfaces and I think of that piece of writing I've read so often by Virginia Woolf the mark on the wall which is an exercise in focus and mindfulness She writes, The slow pulling down of thick green stalks so that the cup of the flower, as it turns over, deluges one with purple and red light. Why, after all, should one not be born there as one is born here, helpless, speechless, unable to focus one's eyesight, groping at the roots of the grass, at the toes of the giants. As for saying which are trees and which are men and women, or whether there are such things, that one won't be in a condition to do for 50 years or so. There will be nothing but spaces of light and dark, intersected by thick stalks, and perhaps higher up, rose-shaped blots of an indistinct colour. The tree outside the window taps very gently on the pane. I want to think quietly, calmly, spaciously, never to be interrupted. 